Good evening and welcome to part two of trying to find Parker at the SS Great Britain. I'm promised he's around here somewhere and he's out. But where are you? Um, guys, he was not there last week. That is new. I promise you. <laughs> Maybe the ball was pushed over him. Oh, dear, dear. Oh, look. The gates are actually open. I haven't seen these gates open, like, ever. Is that Mr. Buna in the corner I can see? Love these paper clippings, the replicas they've got up on the wall. And it cost to Melbourne 65 and 75 guineas. Well, that's after saloon or second class. So that's another one down. <laughs> now that's some big chains. I'm not quite sure what that is, but it's very, very big. As I'm up here, I thought I'd show you something that I'm particularly interested in. I love coming up here every time I come up here for no apparent reason. I work in Bristol. I have animation. I don't know what this building is. There's a little clue. We're currently on Gas Ferry Road. And this is the headquarters of Urban Animations. See, there's more from the window. And there's Wallace. And there's Gromit. And a few other little clay. Like Pac-Man. Oh, <laughs> and the rabbits. I have no idea if you can see any of this, by the way. It's silly, I know, but I love coming up here just to see that building. They don't make all their feature films there, though. Those are made in Aztec West. That's where kind of the animation, their computer animation units are based. And some, of the, some of their smaller animations are based there, but their large animations are like Chicken Run and all that was done at Aztec West. It's so cool to come here and find the home. It used to be a, I think it used to be a fish storage place or something. The more you know. So you might notice there's rather more boats and things on the harbour today. And that's because the harbour festival is coming this weekend. So it's a little bit busier than normal. Now that's what you call an anchor. Looks very old then. I could not come past this and not show you this. This little ducky collection. Oh my gosh, there's more down there. Oh my gosh. They are so cute. It's almost like an alphabet duck. Uh, that's got to be the coolest collection of ducks I've seen. Guys, I think we know whose boat this belongs to. Captain Morgan, you're making it very clear. <laughs> well, this is a nice little marina. I don't think I've ever seen this one before, actually. Have you ever had one of these moments where you can see what you want to get to, but you can't quite get to it? <laughs> see that spire? That's where I'm aiming for. So I'm hoping I can go up this road and turn left. But we'll see. Wish me luck. This road is looking very promising. I can see a building that I recognise, that's always a good sign. And there it is, just poking out the trees. St Mary Radcliffe. We'll be there in a few minutes. I wonder what kind of view they have up there. I've never seen them before. So as you might have guessed, we have now arrived at St Mary Radcliffe. Now Parker's supposed to be around here somewhere, but I don't see him. I'm fairly sure he's missing on the grass in front of it. But I don't see it here. <laughs> this is another one they're hiding him from me again. It's alright, it's alright. I found him. He's, he's over there. As you can see, the little blue dog is just there. But all the gates into the grounds are locked. So if you want to get that one, you need to come on. St. America is open. So I was hoping to get two. I got one and a bit, you might say. I can't believe this. It was, it was not there <laughs> last time I looked. I'm going to look at the footage now, but it was, it was not there. <laughs> Shame about St. Mary Radcliffe, but these things happen. Though I do think it should probably have been outside the gates. Maybe we should start a campaign. Free Parker. Free Parker. Free Parker. <laughs> 
with that being said, thanks so much for watching and maybe I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.